go outside? Let's go! Well, hello everyone. This is Ranger Rob from the Ranger Rob Country Living Channel. Good to see you guys. Um, winter's here for sure. <laughs> the pond's looking kind of sad. I'm probably going to have to shut her down and clean it out a little bit because my uh, water's not running very, very fast. And uh, then I'm going to have to start dealing with freezes. So, gosh, everything looks so different this time of year. All the leaves are gone. But anyway, I was going to tell you about a project we're going to uh, get going here pretty soon. Uh, the greenhouse is kind of held up. Um, so the good news, uh, don't talk about personal stuff too much, but I did mention that my wife just got employed. And uh, kind of a long story, it wasn't a bad thing or a good thing. But when her father passed away a year ago, was about the time she got uh, laid off and got a six year, a six month uh, payment program, I, I can't remember the name of it, um, <coughs> that kind of helped us make it through up to like April. And then uh, she had to go on unemployment. At the same time, we were trying to take care of her mom. We decided to purchase this house over here and uh, five acres and bring her back to where she used to live. She's in assisted living. <laughs> so uh, in the meantime, with the proceeds from our house in uh, Phoenix, we got kind of debt free. And uh, so we were able to survive just fine, but it was definitely tight. And uh, the other thing is we didn't have very good health care. And we've solved all that. So that's a blessing that we're very happy about. But what I wanted to talk about also was well, that good news that my wife is working and we have health insurance again is along this fence line. Now I've told you that our property, we have five acres. Only like two acres, two and a half acres are fenced with a deer fence. And so we do all of our gardening and everything inside the deer fence. But outside, we have lots of property too. So if we ever decide to get sheep or something, we have lots of property to do that. But along here, we get a lot of sun. And when we clean this out, we're finally kind of figuring out what all the water systems are. We found out when we blew <laughs> that one of, one of the hoses here, the cap came off. And... Uh, Plus, it kind of helped me discover that it was there. But all along this fence line, we're going to put a trough above ground uh, uh, planter boxes all the way down, about two, two and a half feet wide, about 24 inches high, because I, I want them up where you can reach them easily. Nothing but strawberries. <laughs> all strawberries. Cannot wait. I love strawberries. And so we'll tap into that water system there, which will take care of this watering these uh, strawberries automatically. So we're really excited about that. The other thing we're doing is next month, now that our finances are a little looser, uh, we are purchasing a freeze dryer. And uh, uh, especially since we're going to really be going hog wild on the garden next year, uh, you cannot beat what a freeze dryer can do. And the fact of uh, when, uh, when you go to a farmer's market and you see good deals on a case of uh, green beans and stuff and you go, oh, that's just way too much food, I gotta store it. Instead of having to can it and all that stuff, uh, freeze drying is amazing. Uh, what a way to preserve food. I just think, I know those are expensive and yes, we'll get the one with the better motor. So we're probably looking at about 3,600 bucks. That's gonna hurt. However, the takeaway is outstanding. So the other thing going on today, <laughs> so I can't, uh, is uh, we're having our stove replaced. So uh, I'll show that to you in a minute. That just check on the chickens. Chickens are doing good. Got lots of food and water. Um, the big chip, the big, big thing we got to test here is uh, 
Do we have eggs yet? When are we going to get our first egg? Could this be the first day? And all I see is it's time to clean the back out. But I don't see any eggs. So once the, um, I thought I'd tell you is, once we start seeing eggs, you see the side walls here? We have them uh, temporarily blocked. And that's for the sides here. When they start laying, we, uh, let me get this closed up here a little bit. We'll uh, open those up and then we'll start these nesting boxes to, uh, uh, to receive their eggs and we'll get our eggs out of there. So we're waiting for that cool day when we can open up the rest of the chicken coop and uh, the dogs are having a blast. Look at those two. They just never stop. So anyway, let me uh, take you in the house real quick and I'll show you why we're, we're placing our stove. Sorry the lighting's not the best in here, but this is our kitchen. And this stove, um, Sherry's father put in a long time ago. And it's got one of these uh, little built-in grills. And those grills, <laughs> she's making a mess there. These grills, they look really cool. And it seems like it's a really nice way to cook. And it does have a built-in fan right here, which works really well and goes out outside. However, um, the burners are kind of getting worn out. They're not heating equally. And to use this is really a pain. It's hard to clean. So we're going to put in a normal <laughs> um, burner stove in here. A uh, brand new one. We uh, took advantage of the uh, uh, Black Friday sales and bought ours at uh, Home Depot. So that's going to get delivered today. So Lord knows what kind of problems we'll have. Uh, when they pull this out because this is connected to a uh, an output fan uh, output uh, in the wall and I think I have to block that so I'm sure that's going to be some new issue nothing goes smooth you know that so anyway so we are looking forward to that they should be here in a few hours and uh, in the future in the in the future video I'll let you know what problems I might have had so anyway so those are kind of some of the things going on around here been a really busy week uh, as you know we uh, uh, we have uh, other shows we do and we also launched a new television station on Roku it's been insane getting that all set up it's running uh, if you go to Roku and just type in cutting edge TV uh, in the search uh, and just hit add to, add to uh, channels there you go. You can watch all of our shows. So anyway, guys, I want to wish you all really uh, nice uh, December and nice holidays. And uh, tomorrow uh, we have a She Said, He Said coming on. So it's always a fun show to watch. And lots of stuff going on. So um, please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos. And press the little bell that goes ding. And uh, uh, be reminded whenever we have a new video. Anyway guys, have a great day. Bye now. Thank you very much for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Thanks.